All right, so we're back with more World of Horror. Uh, I'm really enjoying this so far. This is really cool. Um, let's just get right into it. Um, so, let's go to school. I can investigate or go to one of these. Uh, do I want spells? That seems cool. Yeah, let's get spells. He'll get the librarian. Many of the books you can find here were donated after the accident at the university building. Uh, study old tombs. <laughs> study old tomes. Plus spell. Plus three percent doom. Make notes. Okay, let's go. Let's go spell. Uh, carry out an old dusty tome to the main reading room. Interpreting the old and complete translation is a tedious task. Finally, or you find a fragment you're looking for. New spell. Uh, and book and go back. Turn the book and exit the library. Exit the library. Okay, yeah. So, what spell did I get? Uh, it's if if though to flame. Ca deals eight damage. Um, plus two percent doom. Cost one reason, one stamina. Forget the spell. Cast the spell. So let's investigate the school, that's what it's telling us to do. You stumble upon the computer room. This is a good opportunity to check the school's database for anything that might help with the investigation. Uh, yeah. It's a complete waste of time. You spent the whole day reading about cute dogs, giant vegetables, and the occasional axe, and you find nothing related to case at all. <sighs> Great. kinda has been missing since yesterday. You decided to check out the neighbor's apartment yourself. She's probably dead. Uh. Oh, okay, yeah. So I have to. You cautiously enter your neighbor's kitchen. You are shocked to, s to find countless jars full of eels flailing around Russell. Where the hell is Kana? Uh, escape, check the bathroom. Check the ba- <laughs> I thought there were two options to check the bathroom. Uh, hell yeah. A soul and body of your neighbor is rotting away inside the putrid, murky water. Both of those are missing with countless tiny blood trails reading from them in all directions. Alright, that was a bad idea. Uh, check the bedroom. Oh! Uh, you finally find Kana. I finally f I found the neighbor, but when his eye bursted, I slipped blood and lost consciousness. I'm f I'm afraid- I'm afraid there's something in my own eye, too. We must go to the hospital. We must puncture her eye now. Uh, let's go to a hospital. We're just coming to the hospital, getting a lot of attention from horrified people. Your friend is taken immediately to the operating theater, and you wait, and you collapse on a chair in the waiting area. Okay, I don't have another option. When you wake up, it's already night. I'm trying to ask about your friend, you are met with weird reactions, as if she never existed. You rush the operating theater yourself, but you're stopped by armed policemen. Whatever happened, the doctors must have been too late to help her. You still process the events of the previous night. Corpse eating eels that lay in their eyes. Sitting before you, you sitting before your apartment building, you watch police officers emptying your neighbor's place. You wonder if you'll ever hear from your friends again. You have so, ending B. Result rewards for solving this mystery. <laughs> uh, I guess that was yeah. We solved that. Knowledge is key. Plus thirty XP. Uh, through investigation. Plus fifteen XP. There's still hope. Minus three doom. Time passes one day. Was that all in one day? No. Oh, good steroids. Click here to reveal its effects. Friendly dog disappeared last night. You have to find a new place to buy clothes. No! Dog! Okay. A feeling of paranoia and discomfort is almost palpable in the air. As doom progresses, all gods' influence will slowly corrupt and change this colony's side down. Okay, so Akana, she's dead I guess, uh, so I can level up, Concu I have a concussion? Bruh! Uh, town status, yeah, there's a, uh, you, level up, uh, let's see, you've advanced to the next experience level, choose one perk and one style upgrade, um, uh, so 
the wait. faster offensive actions. Uh, regain one stamina for all past events. Wait, regain one stamina for all past events. Skill checks. Or for all past events. Skill checks. Okay. Uh, and improve resting at home. Uh, it's faster. I have to do faster offensive actions. Um, let's do this. Um, oh, okay. If I can hear up a sat or up my, like, stamina or reason. Ah. Uh, sup. Strunk. Yeah. Nice. I'm a fast swimmer now, hell oh, yeah. So, okay. Lighthouse. Anomalous Lighthouse has been cloned down for a long game forever. Hell yeah, enter that lighthouse. Multiple havocs prevent you from entering the building. You need five keys. Okay, so that's a goal, I guess. Yeah, I'm back. Uh, leave. Center me on box and find a small key. What is it doing in here? Uh... I can hear anything you know, you're currently not investigating any weird mystery. Uh, recent newspaper clippings and notes collected in the next room should point you in the right direction. Uh, okay. Alright, so, open drawer. Awesome. <laughs> um, I do anything else. I can start a new mystery with the Scooby Gang. Uh, so I need more reason. I'm kind of running low on that. Um, let's see, a ramen shop up here is where I was made once. The ramen shop sold inside is made from his former patrons but cure any health from. Cool. Uh, change? Sure. Take a bath. Stamina, XP, reason, reason. Um, a twenty percent doom. Uh, nothing. Uh, okay, let's start a new mystery. So, finish the eels. <laughs> Um, Contagious Coma, uh, Morbid Mermaids, Violent Vigil, Fear Festival. Fear Festival sounds like something out of Goosebumps book, so. Uh, Far Out Fable of Fear Festival. Your aunt has sent you a letter, inviting to you to curiously s to a curious sounding festival. It's held every 27 years in a small village. You don't like the sound of it, but your parents both agree you need a break from all the stress. Inside the th inside the letter is a bus ticket. What's the worst that could happen? You ask yourself as you board the bus. <laughs> Today's goal, explore the weird village. Just when you thought your stomach couldn't handle anymore, the janky old bus stops at its destination. You get up and take a deep breath before looking around. It's a small village, and the nearby fields are surrounded by a thick forest. Uh, someone's waiting for you. Just continue, just continue. Uh, oh, this is... Oh. So do they each have, like, different gameplay styles or something? A group has arrived in the village and is currently unpacking at the inn, giving you some time to explore. Festival begins in the morning. For the rest of this mystery, choose the actions that will advance the clock. As you learn about the terrible secret of this village, more actions will unlock. Oh. In this room is dusty, and it's like it hasn't seen an event. You wonder if anyone has cleaned it in the last festival 27 years ago. There's a folder of various activities lying in the Ah. Uh, let's see. Sure. Uh, plus two. Okay. So, enjoy the festival. It advances the clock. Free action. So, that's what they should do is that advances the clock, right? 
to investigate the village. You stand out in the middle of fear, frozen in terror. A ripped reality shows a horrible feature of our planet. Seeing a familiar figure looking back at you, you can't help but wonder if it's our own solution. Question my sanity. Oh, nothing will ever be the same. Oh, branded. Chance of a raising tomb each investigation. Oh no. Oh, let's enjoy the festival. There's still some time before the festival starts. Locals are seemingly busy setting up stands. A few stands are already open, but you can check out the singing song as long as it's getting late. Um, look for friends. Some of your friend, Yoichi. Hey, I'm trying to solve a puzzle. Can you help? <laughs> help. More about the festival itself. A weird sound wakes you up. You step closer to the window and look out. You can't see anything and get ready to go back to bed when suddenly the moon comes out from behind thick clouds. Three hooded figures standing at the forest edge. One by one, they light their torches and disappear from the tree. What's that all about? Who are they? Uh, yeah, yeah. What was that all about? They wore strange masks. Should you follow them into the forest? Try to find more information about them? Okay. So, skip time. Explore forest. Explore village. Is it in? Let's explore forest. You have a feeling they're being watched. When you hear a branch snapping, you quickly turn around. There underscore someone. There is underscore someone underscore standing in the trees, just a few meters away. Send park ranger. Uh, confront the person. I got this. Hey, it's just a creepy scarecrow. <laughs> uh. So, is it in? Uh. Action available. Uh, can I go back? Uh, relax a little. One reason in stamina. Uh, how many days do I have? Oh, are these the different mysteries? One, two, three, four, five. I would imagine so. I still have the eel note. <laughs> oh, what? Legend from the to a small village of robbers who would kill all of their duffer corpse. Alright, uh, yeah, that's going in storage. I don't, I don't want that. Uh, should I investigate the forest at night? Someone is watching, okay. Let's just enjoy the festival. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's getting late. Buy souvenirs. Dog is back! Plus one luck wall in the inventory. Uh, plus one stamina, plus one luck. It's two luck. Uh, I have I have six ones. Let's get the lucky earrings. You hear two mass villagers. They are talking about something. Awakening to the next dawn. You wonder what that's up. It's not safe here. Next thing you hear, hear two mass villagers. Okay, here before I forget, let me equip this. Yep. Uh, they were talking about something. You decide to block the entrance to your room with a night sand. Festival's ending tomorrow. You can't be too careful. Yeah, we need to investigate. In this big village, you look at the most beautiful flowers. Surprise, surprise. As you get closer to calm in the gardener, you stop hearing weird sniffling, sniffling sounds. Alright. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Just, I'm not gonna question it. Uh, so I haven't based all that still. Uh, 80% chance of hitting. I'm in 42 time. So I can get two strong attacks in, giving me 12 damage. Or, I can do. Four normals. Uh, give me 16. So that'll just be better. Yeah. Nice. 
Hits me with a spade. Oh no, a spade. Okay. Dead now. I got a shovel, nice. Uh... It sounds like a forest kept you up all night, what could it mean? Shovel. Uh... Let's see. So it does more damage, lowers speed, lower chance to hit. Uh, nah. Store until I like the base wall up. Explore the forest. What spot finally makes you stop? You slowly turn around to see a young girl slowly walking in your direction. In her eyeball, there's a swarm of disgusting worms. One of them falls to the floor with a wet splash. Alright then. You wanna get you wanna get the bat? You get the bat. Nice. Scratches my face. Well, too bad for you, you're about to die. Why is it so quiet all of a sudden? Is that blood? Where is everybody? Find the missing people. Hero of blood and sickly smelling sludge leads to an outskirt of the village. Somewhere in the dark forest is an answer waiting for you. Uh, are you walking in circles? Rest of camp, explore forest. A suspicious group you've been following is gathered in a nearby forest. They're enacting some sort of ritual on a clearing up ahead. The only nearby vantage point is a large rock. Um, tough to climb. Okay, minus two stamina. Mm. Yeah, keep keep going. They said that a famous priest died on this rock. Perhaps his mysticism was seeped into it. Uh. Tapped into its power. Damn it. What? What you thought as you What you thought was just the discarded pile of clothes suddenly moves to stand out as kind of white power boost in the air enemy. Sport <laughs> God. <laughs> okay. Oh. All right. Uh. So, Kinunko Gather. So I have this spell. Can I use it? it deals eight damage plus two percent doom. Oh, sure, cast it. Calm of fire and the enemy. Okay. Yeah, that did do quite a bit of damage. Uh, there you go. Long sequence. Didn't stand a chance. Stabs me with a knife. That's a problem. <laughs> there we go. In a factory, everyone. This must be a place that they took everyone. I'll explain the factory. You're caught by mass people you've seen in the end's window. Tied up, they bring you to the cult leader. We knew you'd come. You hear a raspy voice. Your aunt's voice. Coming behind you, weird priest mass. She signals towards the door. Our master is waiting for the final blood sacrifice. With a loud bang, the ancient horde disappears and the high priest falls to the floor, grabbing their shoulder. The last thing you see before blacking out are the beams of flashlight in the hand of police officers saving you from the fall. Later that day, detectives are interrogating you about you are Detectives interrogating you are confused when you tell them about the ritual, blood and elders beings. But your village is abandoned with no trace of blood anywhere. You were the only one seeing the ancient horror. Far out fable of Fear Festival ending a 
While you couldn't catch the leader of the cult to interrogate them, the people are safe. Uh, you board the old bus wondering what would happen if you didn't s stop the ritual in time. Uh, rewards, 30 XP, 15 XP, my 3 doom, tireless. Okay. So, right. Dangerous bands, dangerous bands of riders are gathering. Downtown Ontario, the police are hopeless. Okay. Was that a good thing? Did I, like, did I do a good? Take Oh, okay, so I guess every time I solve a mystery, I get one. Alright. So, I need to, I need to take a bath. Um. Let's get... Hot water. There we go. Uh. Guess start a new mystery. Yeah, let's start a new mystery. So, violent vigil, contagious coma, morbid mermaids. I'm I'm, I'm interested in the morbid mermaids. Uh, the janitor was obsessed with mermaids. He collected every scrap of the legend about them in the school basement. Now his mind has snapped. He's decided it's time to make one of his own, using the bodies of one of the unfortunate students as his materials. Answer this mystery, investigate the circled location. As you progress, the location may equation and the rules may change. So, there's one thing at, at the school... There's one thing everyone at the school will talk about. Another girl from your area has gone missing. Could there be anything connecting all the missing people? I should investigate downtown next. Okay. Let's get the seaside though. Okay, let's go to downtown. Yeah. Uh, the investigation is starting to get toll on your health. You feel like you're about to fall asleep standing up. How do you dress your weekend suit? Uh. Taking that. Uh. Okay. Cool. Uh. Wait, so how much XP do I need to level up? Oh, just a bit more. Okay. So. As you run the neighborhood, you got some results. It seems that all the girls have attended the same school. Okay. Uh, so, let's see the school. This, this door shouldn't be there. It shouldn't lead anywhere. More importantly, it shouldn't pull you in. You should still leave the mysterious door behind. Mine is too sta- Alright, oh, whatever. All missing girls are apparently members of the school swimming team. Maybe someone saw a kid never stalking them. Uh, okay. Just keep... Okay. Nice one modifier to all skill check. Why? Oh, that's because this place is threat level. Alright, whatever. Doomed spells, crew allies, slash like gossip. Uh, no, just keep investigating. You hear a faint sound. This light almost makes you sick, okay. You find a notebook containing handwritten, uh, detailed notes about the also in club member itself and mermaids. Okay. Morbid school. So, there's school in morbid school. What the hell? A nauseating sense stops you. Someone has scattered rotting fish guts everywhere and hung up countless fish heads. You cover your mouth as you slowly retreat. A vast flock of seals outside viciously attack the windows. Whoever the kidnapper may be, they seem to be really obsessed about mermaids. Inside the science lab, you find a plan of the town's sewer system. Someone has been- someone has marked a path leading to the sea, directly from the school building. Okay. So... I 
guess. Investigate downtown. Is it a pentagram? You're pleasantly surprised being your old friend. She's waiting for a train. She's undoubtedly been changed a lot since you've last seen her. These days, she's moderating a web forum dedicated to paranormal me. She has something useful. Pay for coffee. Uh, oh, I got book. Um, in between conspiracy theories and Bigfoot sightings, you hear a worrying rumor about an old god slowly waking to rule the earth once again. Could this uh, be the reason for the recent horrific events? Yeah. Uh, resolve. Okay, so I can level up. Level up. Uh, okay, so quick thinking. There's always a way out. Okay, so plus one dexterity. Prove resting at home. Plus one knowledge. Okay. Let's get extra dexterity. And then more knowledge. Continue. There's something wrong here. A weird apathy has seemed to infect every adult you ask for help. You have to deal with it alone. Okay. Dark forces scheme against you. You don't know who you can trust anymore. <sighs> Cursed again. Uh, ocean is calling. Oh my god, are those gills? <laughs> Wait, I... You compare the sewer plan and school map, and you suddenly and it suddenly dawns on you: school basement. That must be the place those kidnapper keeps the missing swimmers. Okay, yeah, let's go. Let's go to the basement. You stopped by a girl you haven't seen in months, but how could you stand that? Oh, this again. Uh, that's just. Uh, what's this guy's kind of spell? Why not? There's only two percent doom. Uh, yeah, cast. Yeah, that doesn't cost like anything, too. Which is great. Didn't even get a chance. There's no turning back now. God, let's hope she she's all right. Oh, Excuse me, school. You bust through the door to the gin tornado closet, but it's already too late. The latest missing girl is lying in a dirty mattress, the upper part at least. A tail of fish has been cruelly sewed in place of her legs. She was too weak and died. You hear Mad Jane Odor say. He looks you up and down. Maybe you'll do. The janitor picks up the bloody axe. Alright, you wanna go? Bet. I got this. You got us. I can cast flame. Boom. I got a baseball bat. Wait, you stupid axe. Probably won't do any damage. Uh, he swings his axe menacingly. Uh, okay. Um. Just keep doing that. I miss! Yeah, well, I kill him anyway. Uh, body slips to the floor. You pick up his axe, and using it as a crutch, you try to leave his room. Injured and weakened, you slowly lose consciousness to school recorder. Police officers find you a few hours later. No trace of the mad janitor is found, but you will sleep a little better tonight knowing that other students are safe. Uh, ending A. Uh, watch. Okay, so is ending A good? Or is that like the most common? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, what, what did the old god do now? Making it hard to breathe. Your rest action is less effective. Yeah. So I have three keys now. Alright, so I think that'll do for today. Um, like, this is really fun, actually. I'm really enjoying this. Uh, I hope you are too. And I'll try to get these videos out uh, more. So, yeah. I'll see you next video. Bye! <laughs>